Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much and good morning everyone. It's uh, fantastic as usual to be back in India. In fact, it is exactly a year ago and the internet and then of course mobile and cloud. Um, but this is the first time I feel the, what's happening in India and what's happening in the rest of the world. There is no impedance, there is no gap. Uh, if anything, the use cases here that I'll talk a lot about uh, are so unique uh, and are paving their own path. Uh, and that's what's exciting. We're not just talking about AI, we're scaling AI um, and it's a fantastic time uh, to be both doing and learning uh, from each other. This ultimately is going to have an impact on GDP, right? Because at the end of the day, you can only talk about tech uh, as a real thing if it is going to have a real impact in the overall growth of an economy. And in, the, in India's case, uh, as Puneet was saying, definitely today this is one of the highest growth markets. Uh, you see it, the buoyancy of it. Uh, the government and all of you have high ambitions of what's going to happen even by 2025. Uh, and what percentage of that GDP growth is going to actually be driven by AI? I, I want to wrap up where I started. Our mission at the end of the day is to empower every person and every organization in India uh, to be able to achieve more in this age of AI. And in that context, I'm very excited today to even announce a new initiative around skilling. Uh, we are going to equip 2 million plus uh, f uh, people in India with AI skills. Uh, we think that obviously at the end of the day, uh, really taking uh, the, the workforce and making sure that they have the skills in order to be able to thrive in this new age is the most important thing that any of us can be doing and we are you know, happy to play our role in it.